It's the story of the afternoon. She knows I caught her last week. Cheating. I was on my way out to run some errands when I realized I forgot my wallet. I had to turn around to go get it. And when I did, I saw Julie's car parked at my neighbor's house. I didn't know what to do. I didn't know if I should have confronted her right then and there, or do it at all. But then I saw her get into her car and take off towards her place. I had to say something to her. Eric? What are you doing here? Who is that guy? What? The guy with the red douche car, my neighbor? Oh, him? I took some classes with him at the U. Don't lie to me. I know you're lying. I saw you kiss him. Eric, I'm not lying. Oh, so what does he teach? African art history. It, I had a question on an assignment and I asked him about it. Dental hygienists take African art history? Yes, it was an elective. What are you trying to say? You kissed him. Aaron, wait. Wait. We'll talk about this tomorrow, right? Okay? Tomorrow was four days later. We are just now talking about it. Or I guess we will, when she shows up. So you look well. Have you been seeing a trainer? I haven't been seeing anyone. What's wrong? Well, I've been here for a while. You're late. I haven't talked to you in four days. And on top of that, these booths are really uncomfortable. Look, I'm sorry I'm late. Does she take me for an idiot? Does she really think I don't know who that text is going to? I really wish I weren't here right now. So how long have you been seeing this guy? What's his name? His name is Reg. Well, his name is Dr. Cutler. He's my How long have you been seeing him? Since the beginning of the semester. So, not very long, huh? She just lies to me and acts like it's nothing. I really want her to shut up. I could stab her to death back in the alley. That would be worth going to an insane asylum. It's better that than having to go there for believing her bullshit lies. practicing it for many years. Dreams we be nefarious, and your dreams known as the scariest. I left an everlasting thought, now you will seek a therapist. Roman in your wake, rock the mic with a quake. Always leave the thing running like oil, a quake estate. Aaron, you quick stop. to say you run your tracks, Kenyan relay, but I still rip on Aaron, no stop. That's really annoying. Hey! Forget this. What's new with you and your boyfriend? Oh, nothing much. It's just the whole thing.
Hey. How are you this morning? I didn't hear from you last night after you left. Oh, I'm just fantastic. Not very good. Why is that? I've been thinking a lot about what you wrote to me on my phone. I hope it makes you feel like the piece of shit that you are. You lied to me, Julie. You've been lying to me for a while now, and I don't really appreciate the way you've been treating me either. Look, I know saying sorry won't take back what I did, but I'd like to try to make it up to you. I'm not into this fake whatever it is you're doing. Just stop. Please. I see nothing good coming out of this. Aaron? Are you there? What? Yeah, I'm here. Okay, good. I thought I lost you. Listen, what you said to me made me realize that I need some soul searching. I can be a better person for you. Just you have to let me. Can we please put all of this behind us? I don't know, this whole Dr. Cutler thing's got me pretty messed up. Who? Aaron? Hello? You were the one who sent us to do such a task, Aaron. What? I have no idea what you're talking about! What has been deleted cannot be undone. Well, yeah, but... You mean to say I've been deleted? Forgotten? Forgotten you have been. Oh, <laughs> God.